next type of question that we're going to look at is one where the answer is not going to be a whole number so we're going to be dealing with decimals and the question that I've chosen to look at is 295 divided by 4 and when we've answered this correctly we'll be able to say that 4 times the answer equals 295 so we need to set this up as we have done before with our 4 times table once times 4 equals 4 2 times 4 equals 8 3 times 4 equals 12 4 times 4 equals 16 5 times 4 equals 20 6 times 4 equals 24 and 7 times 4 equals 28 and 8 times 4 equals 32. So we're going to set the sum up as we have before. So the 4 is outside the symbol which represents the division and 295 inside. So the first question, does 4 go into 2? No, 4 doesn't go into 2. Does 4 go into 29? Yes, it does. 7 times 4 is 28. So when we're dividing 4 into 29, we say it goes 7 times, and then we need to work out the remainder. So 4 sevens are 28. And 9 minus 8 is 1. 2 minus 2 is 0. So as before, the next step is to bring the 5 down and say, how many times does 4 go into 15? 3 times 4 is 12, so 4 goes into 15 3 times, and four, 3 times 4 is 12. So we're going to take the 12 away from the 15. 5 from 2 is 3, and 1 from 1 is 0. Now, all numbers, if we were going to write them completely, are followed by, if you put the decimal point in, they're followed by zeros. So we can put the zeros in behind the 295. So 295 decimal point zero zero. We then bring the zero down. So the next question is, how many times does four go into 30? Seven times four is 28. So we're saying seven times, and seven times four, as I said, is 28. So we need to take that away from the 30, as we've done before. Zero minus eight, we can't do. So we take a 10 from the 30. So it becomes 10 minus eight. And 10 minus eight is two and then we bring the next zero down and ask ourselves how many times does 4 go into 20? Well, 5 times 4 is 20 so the answer to that is 5 and 5 times 4 is 20 and for completion we write the 20 down and show that there are no remainders 0 from 0 is 0 2 from 2 is 0 so the answer to the question 295 divided by 4 equals 73.75 and 4 times 73, and I've got to squish that in a bit, 73.75 equals 295.